Welcome! In the previous video, we have seen how to sign up for a new GitHub account and create a private repository. Check out the link above for the previous video. And let us, today, see how to manage revisions from other contributors for a private repository. Let's get started. In the previous video, we have already created a Python file called add.py. Now you would like to add a collaborator who is part of your team and can help in reviewing and building the code. To add him into your repository, firstly you have to send him an invitation. For that, go to settings, manage access and click on invite a collaborator. In my case, I have another user with a username contributor1 whom I want to add as a contributor. I go back to my account that is code challenge123 and I just click on invite a collaborator and type in his username here. It says awaiting contributor one's response. The contributor will receive an invitation email. The email says code challenge one to three has invited you to his repository. Click on view invitation and accept the invitation. Here you go. The contributor can now have access to the repository where he can see the files, he can see the code as well. Now if he wants to revise or extend the code, then just clicks on edit symbol and starts to type in the revisions. To summarize what has been done, the contributor has extended the code to perform multiplication of two numbers as well. And then types in commit changes as updated add.py to perform multiplication. And he can click on commit directly to the master branch and then on commit changes. You see that the code is modified in the repository by the contributor. Now if I reload, I see a notice that the contributor1 has updated add.py for performing multiplication. To compare what has been revised, just click here. You can see what modifications have been made. If you would like to comment on it, you can write your comment here. If you go to code and commits, you can see that a new version is created and the old version still remains in the repository. That's all for today. In the next video, we can see how to update revisions to a new branch and merge them together. If you like this video and want more videos on GitHub, please subscribe to my channel. Bye-bye.